Hi, I am Nate Nagel from Menham, New Jersey, and I am here to interview J.D. Davis from the New York Mets. Okay, J.D., what is your favorite part about being a Major League Baseball player? My favorite part, I would say, going from city to city, seeing every stadium, seeing fans. I think it's just like the, you dream about when you're younger. Um, being a big leaguer is a, it is a big deal, mm -hmm. um, and it's a dream for a lot of kids, and I'm very blessed to be, you know, call myself a big leaguer, so I would say that's pretty coolest part mm -hmm. of it. Following up to my next question, what, did, what advice do you have for a long, young player like me whose dreams is to play in the major leagues? Um, I would say the best advice I would say is you can never do enough work. I would say not just the, just the physical part but the mental part as well. Um, as you get older, um, my dad, um, he explained the talent system as if it was going up a pyramid. Mm -hmm. And as you go up a pyramid, there's less space for all the players to fit into that top of the pyramid. So what defines them or separates them is the mental toughness um, and the mental way of playing the game. So I would say that in that regard, but as your case, when you're so young, uh, get as many reps as you can um, and just continue to work hard. Um, and again, there's never enough work, even if after practice, in you know your travel ball or high school, hit in the cage, take some extra ground balls, do whatever. Okay, makes sense. Who is the toughest pitcher to face? Let's see. I would say uh, our toughest one is the guy that's on our team right now, Max Scherzer. It's pretty tough. I would say Jacob, but Jacob's on the shelf right now. Yeah, <laughs> that makes sense. Yeah, I'm bummed about that one. All right. What is your favorite baseball movie that you've watched growing up? Uh, I would do The Natural. Uh, a little bit old school. Um, yeah. I loved it. Nice. What other sports did you play growing up? Uh, I was a three sport guy. I uh, played football and basketball um, mm -hmm. growing up and then uh, pretty much it was between football and baseball really. Basketball was kind of a third option. Um, I played it all the way up to middle school and I played one year in high school but that was pretty much it. Nice. Who was your favorite team and player when you were growing up? Favorite team growing up, uh, I grew up in Southern California, so I've probably gone to maybe a couple dozen to quite a few dozen uh, Dodger games. Nice. Um, and my family is big Dodger fans, so growing up there, and then obviously when you're a kid and you get your first PlayStation or something like that, and I started playing with Boston Red Sox, so the Red Sox, I loved the Red Sox growing up too. Nice. Uh, favorite players, I mean, it could be all over the map. I know I, I love David. I love David Wright the way he was playing. Yeah. Um, and you know Ken Griffey when he was mm -hmm. younger. I mean, you can go down the list of so many good guys. But um, yeah, I go that. Mm, nice. What is your proud proudest accomplishment as a player so far? I would say the number one thing would probably be just the walk off. I think that was a pretty cool accomplishment. That yeah. was my first ever walk off. Um, mm -hmm. and just be a part of it during that hunt in 2019 where we were trying to get into the playoffs and it was against the Indians as well. Mm -hmm. um, they were a playoff team and um, just coming through in that moment, that was pretty cool. Nice, and my final question for you today is if you could, have only, if you could only have one, would you rather be in the Hall of Fame or win a World Series? Oh man, that's a good question. Um, I would say probably be in the Hall of Fame. Okay. That would be pretty cool. Nice. That'd be really cool. Is that it? That's all the questions you got? Yep. All right, cool, man. Well, how, old are, how old are you? I am 11 years old. 11 years old. Oh, so mm -hmm. what grade is that? Fifth grade. Fifth grade. That's a good grade. You'd be 12 and under, right? Um, ball or something like that? Yeah, 11 you, 12 you. 12 you? Mm -hmm. Okay, gotcha. That's pretty cool. I like those years. Those are my favorite years right before high school. Mm hmm. Well, well Nice meeting you. Thank nice you so much. Nice to some questions. Mm -hmm. Appreciate it. And uh, we'll do it next time. Mm -hmm.